So here's a product that sucks. Or does it? I mean, maybe that's what it's supposed to do, right? And I can honestly feel your eye rolls right now going, suction cup mount, really? Well, I've tried to use suction cup mounts in the past and they're just not reliable enough. And Telson sent me this one and said, this one is reliable. And if they're right, well, I think this could actually be a hugely underrated product for what you can use it for, especially with the GoPro. So stick around and I'll show you why. Black. Welcome to the channel, my name is Danny Black and I love to review cool gear that comes my way. As always, links to everything we're talking about are down in the description, plus a surprise link. And uh, you know what, let's get right to it. The company Telesyn sent me this and said, this is the best suction cup bracket out there. And I was like, okay, sure, we'll see. And I will say it's made really well. It's very strong, but is also lightweight, which is what you need. It has a really easy adjustable arm with two ball heads on it, so you don't need to fiddle with a bunch of different levers. If you've used these before, you'll know the frustration of trying to get the shot just right when you have a bunch of different levers and then this falls off. So an adjustable arm like this will make it so much easier. It has a built-in GoPro mount, but also comes with a little accessory that goes to a screw thread so you can put any camera on there or your phone as well. And actually, now that I think of it, this could be really good for those makeup tutorial content creators out there. You just pop this on your mirror and you could see yourself and you could do your tutorial just right there. Anyway, I've actually never really considered a mount like this because I have had some in the past and they were never really reliable. I'd put them on like a window or even like a car and it would just, but I've been using this one for a while now and I find that it is very handy and just a very underrated product for the GoPro. Because when you're out and about and you just wanna get some really quick creative shots, you can pop this on any window or anything with a shiny surface, but use your best judgment and don't try anything stupid with it. But this thing is the strongest I've used. So this gives you the ability to get really creative with your shots in an easy way. When you're done, you just, you know, pop it off and you move to the next shot. If you've never considered something like this for your GoPro or your phone or action camera, I really think you should. And you should really consider this one right here because this is a lot more reliable and built a little bit better than what I've seen before. But I think this is one of those GoPro accessories that are just great to have in that GoPro toolbox of yours. And guess what? It comes in at 25 US dollars. But always check the link in the description because it could be cheaper. You never know, prices do change and sometimes I get coupon codes. So make sure you check down in the description. Thanks again for joining me on another review and I have a lot of content and gear to get to. This channel is kind of taking over my life and uh, I love it. So if uh, you enjoy this, please let me know with uh, one of these things. And if you also wanna maybe support a little bit further, check out my memberships. Also, Tech is Hard podcast, always a fun time chatting we're doing some live streams there uh looking at some of the new tech that's coming out so check that out click over there and uh, subscribe and click the bell so you get notified when we go live all right cool thanks for watching and i'll catch you on the next one